Pisces, welcome to your reading for mid-May to June of this current year. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So this resonates with you a good deal. If not, don't worry about it, none. It's not a big deal. It's just a card game after all. It's just a card game. Na -na. Oh, oh, okay. Ooh. Do you tend, like, things just didn't come together somewhere, maybe? Or someone just went out of their way to be a little bit frivolous and then, like, kind of gaslit you about it? Blamed you for it, possibly? Possibly. Doesn't have to be for all of you. Um, kind of restricting yourself. Um, but definitely losing some patience after this person made you feel like they were betraying you or you them. Could be either or. We also have cross watchers here, so we have to keep in line with them. Right? Now, if you want a personal reading, just hit me up in my email in the description box below. I don't charge, but I do take tips and donations. That's why my PayPal is there as well. So, have at you. Eight of Swords. Ha! Ah, that actually goes with it. How about you? Feeling confined in the mind right now. Bad judgment calling in the wants and wishes, possibly. Something not being resurrected. We have the Three of Cups and the Fears and Rejections. Are you afraid of having a good time or just cutting loose and let dry? Or a bunch of people like congregating against you, you feel like? Ace is not swords, wands right here, taking action, taking initiative in the situation where you're feeling constrained in your mind. You, Pisces, are the person you're dealing with. But the obstacles and challenges coming against you is the Two of Swords Reverse. Not really knowing what kind of decision to make between, like, these bitches over yonder running their mouth, possibly, and you trying to get out of the said space where they're possibly doing that to you. You really, I don't think, know any idea of how to either create something. Yeah, okay. This is almost completely opposite of what I started reading for you initially when I first laid out these cards. Because I tried to do a reading, and then some people, I guess from Washington or wherever the fuck they came from, started calling. And I don't know who it is. But I don't know anyone who lives in Washington either. <clears throat> and th th now we have justice reversed. And justice was actually upright before. But that was in like your wants and wishes. And now it's in the catalyst as well as the final result. So just to let you know. What? Okay. I don't understand why the universe was fucking with me about shit. Alright. And the beginning theme is this star reverse. Wanting to reach out. Wanting to start some new stuff, wanting to communicate, and that does not happen, and then leaving you just slightly, mm, just slightly miffed, just slightly miffed enough to be like, I don't want any of this anyway, you know, like, I don't care, and shit, just being all off, I'm gonna go to my own world to be my own little thing and shit, yes, yeah, sir, yeah, someone, uh, is trying to turn away from a burden at this point. Like, it's too much. It's already very visibly too much with the Eight of Swords right here. What okay, else can you tell me about the Eight of Swords? Okay. Um, it made somebody feel like they can't be themselves. It makes someone feel like that they are confined in this box and are made very, very little. Like, none of their dreams can come true from it. <coughs> Jesus. Two seconds. My apologies. I don't know what the hell that was. Other than the gigantic toad in my throat. But yeah, whatever. But yeah. Um, it's just like... It's almost like lowered self-esteem. Like all of this confinement between that and like... These people who I think you might be afraid of gossiping around you. Possibly. It's got you in a bummer sort of mood. And we have the Ace of Wands down here in the situation. There's a new fresh start right there. There's potential for it. Right? Possibly with a Capricorn. Or there's potential after some little sneaksy sneaks. I feel mean, like there's a potential to get away with something like 
to go back, possibly in the past, and manipulate something to happen, or manipulate, I don't know. It's like there is a Capricorn either sneaking in the background, or someone just found an opening for themselves for something. I can't tell, but it's like, they're definitely going about in a very, very mm, manner, right? Now, like, this judgment reversed is the wants and wishes for you. Or you're trying to make a judgment call, but I don't know if you're planning on not resurrecting something or if something just didn't go the way you thought it was. It's also a karma card, too. So something could have led to a wrong choice as well. Um, possibly dealing with the Aries. This is the Emperor's card, or maybe you just lost control in some manner. Either you became too demanding in your royalties and whatnot, or you just became way too lenient with that, but it was the wrong judgment call. Or maybe you made a judgment call in choosing this person right here, since it also deals with choice. Now, we have the Two of Swords down below. Challenges and obstacles coming against you, which is like having a hard time making a choice. I think it's told us to Cancer, too. Um, choices. They always, like, there's something about their choices that they're picking, right? Um, <clears throat> this inability to come to some sort of decision is a result of um, a wish that came true, but with baggage. It came with hubris. It came with stuff attached to it. Like, someone got what they, exactly what they wished for, but they didn't think of, like, how all of the other stuff attached to that would come with it. Like, you know, babies, mamas, or, like, shitty car insurance, or, like treating somebody badly and then it for somebody else and then that person treating you ten times as worse. Like, stuff like that. Like, that kind of hubris. Like, oh, I made a wish to dump my boyfriend for this guy. Well, that's cool. But now this guy, like, dumps you for somebody who's, like, nowhere close to as cool as you. Right? It's kind of like that. That kind of hubris. You make a wish, but you don't pay attention to how you get it, and the boomerang effect can be astonishing. But I feel like you're not sure how to go about this a little bit. <clears throat> or this person at least doesn't know. Like, they made this wish and it's like they're shocked on their face. Like, oh my god, I can't believe I let this happen. Okay, so this emperor right here is looking at, like, the nine of pentacles. They're both reversed. He's just, like, got his nose snubbed at her, like... What are you looking at? What are you doing? I'm watching you. And right there, that person is standing there looking all meek, but underneath is the devil sneaking. You know, because some people just don't change their ways. Three of Cups up here in the Fierce Rejections. Maybe somebody's gossiping. Maybe somebody's got something to say. They just can't say it through your face. Some secrets are coming out about this. People might be letting things be known. Maybe there are things you didn't know until, like, you overheard these people talking. Or maybe you're afraid people are going to find out about this, too. And down here below in the catalyst as well as the final result, the beginning and the end, what started this? Head over heart decision that's being very, very difficult to make. It looks like you're leaning more towards your heart because you're still looking for a reason to stick around even after the fires have consumed everything. Like, you're reminiscing. You're like, oh, maybe I should go back just to see how things have changed. But, unfortunately, I don't think that things are going to. Someone feels like they're still the backbone in all of this. On Like, their pain is taken as a pleasure for everyone else's expense. So that's why there might be a lack of communication right here. A lack of reaching out. to work on something possibly underground probably using your guides to help them i feel like that's more of a guides card because none of them look like they're even close to being human someone's under a lot of pressure with this emperor down here when it comes to their wishes like that's the fucked up thing their wish is literally what's going against them right now
It's like, because they think that the devil is like this horribly terrible person that's bringing them down. Like, they're going to go do naughty things. Mm. Mind you, the empress is over here watching and she's just like, ah! Like that guy in like body snatchers is snitching just a little bit. Oh, we got two cards. These two opposing people are just going opposing ways. One's gonna go out and search for blood. The other one just is retracting their um, offer. Almost like a bungee or a rubber band coming back into place. This person is retracting an offer and going out like this. This person is retracting their thing and going out like that. It's like... It's like they narrowly missed each other. But I didn't see each other. Their backs are turned. Well, I don't know. You tell me what you think, Pisces. I will see you guys later. You take it easy. Thank you for watching my video, though. Appreciate it very much. Yeah. That's all that helps you out a little bit. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.